All right, YouTubers, here's one of the biggest planes there is. This is the Spruce Goose that Howard Hughes made, and it's completely made out of wood. So look at how large it is. It is gigantic. God, I can't believe I made that. I guess this is the making of the spruce goose. The only thing is I'd hate to be in that if it ever crashed. Can you imagine? So uh, let's go in the spruce goose, shall we? The key to security, victory, and freedom lay in the air. All right, so this is inside the spruce goose. Check it out. It looks like metal. It's really made out of wood. Another compartment down here, fuel tank, compartment access. I guess the cockpit is up there where these stairs are. Hmm. Apparently a lot of it's made out of metal. I can't imagine how heavy this aircraft is. Here's like the ceiling compartment. Inside the spruce goose. Here is the wing of the spruce goose. It's a pretty gigantic. And um, right here, it looks like it's made out of metal, but it's not. It's all wood. See, here's a cross section they cut out to show you that it is all wood, even though it does look metal in here. Everything you see is pretty much wood. So then here you go. There it is. There is the uh, upper level. I don't know why I have. I just uh, intended to bring it with me, but all right. Come to find out, this model you see down here was actually used in the movie The Aviator, and um, the scene you see that they were building it. This is what they built. And they green screen the actors in front of it. Here's a model of it. This was in the aviator. So this was the actual plane that you were seeing when you were looking in the aviators was the model that they made. This is the tail of the Spruce Goose. Check out the tail, the vertical, the horizontal stabilizer here. It's gigantic. And then there's the rudder. I can't believe the scale of this aircraft. Gosh. 